Hi! Today I'm going to do an unboxing video for a new Beyblade set. Here it is. It's the Slingshock Dead Phoenix P4 pack. And I know that you guys have been requesting a Slingshock Bay opening. So I'll go right ahead and see what's inside. Okay guys, so these are pretty cool Beyblades. I have to say, this one, you know the Ripper, the Sing Shock Ripper. You all know about those. But let's just see. Isn't it great just opening a new pack? Okay, we got a Sling Shock Ripper. So that's going to be added to our Rippers. You know that I already. If you watch this channel, you know I already have a bunch of rippers. I don't need any more, but I just have so many. So let's try this out, guys. So it's a bit different than what we're usually used to. But, as you can see, it's very nice. It has these little grippy things that you're supposed to hold, and you let it rip. Okay. That's pretty good. Just gonna put all the garbage over there. We got our instruction manual. Don't need that. We already know Beyblades. Um, this part, I always find it so tough. We got the, oh, we got the, we got the tip out. Okay, here's the tip. For your enjoyment. Come on, focus. Okay, it's not focusing. Here's the tip. <laughs> well, that's just the tip. It is a sling shock tip, so it's pretty cool. Okay. That is gonna go right over there. Okay. Okay. Um. Now for the desk, the metal desk. This is what it looks like. Oh yeah, and just so you know, um, this is Dread Phoenix, and Dread Phoenix is a defense type, so pretty good. And defense, eleven out of eleven. So good. And burst. Guys, the one, the only, the defense outer layer disc. Well, guys, I know if Dead Phoenix or Dread, Dread Phoenix, yes, it's one of the best Beyblades. I have to say, if if I have to say which Beyblade is the best, I'd have to say Dread Phoenix or probably Dread Phoenix. One of them, Red Phoenix. It's just so good. I, sorry, guys, I'm trying to figure out. Oh. Okay, guys, I'm sorry, I will be back. Okay, I'm here. Okay, I, I'm sort of cheating, but let's just use our scissors. To cut open, look at this. The Dread Phoenix Energy Layer. Isn't it beautiful, guys? Just look at it. And this one is very cool because I think you can put these together. And then when it gets hit too many times, it comes off. But instead of bursting, it's, a, it's a defense layer comes off. So, that's pretty cool. And I'll see you guys in the battle. Hey guys, what's up? I'm back here, and let's test out Dread Phoenix. First, we'll get it, give it a little test spin, and then let's battle. Okay, let's go. Okay. Three, two, one, let's go. That is a beautiful. Oh. 
just saying right now, it's in attack mode, I believe. So that is Dread Phoenix's attack mode. And this is him with his outer layer. Actually, let's give him a spin without his outer layer on. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's possible. Yep, three, two, one, one, three. Without his outer layer on, he's much wider so he can spin faster. Guys, I'm gonna do there. Can I get it on him? No, he doesn't want it. Okay, guys. Now it's battle time. Nice. Three, two, one, let it rip. Hit burst finish. No way. Did you nice. see that? Three, two, one, let it rip. Three, two, one, let it rip. Ring out finish. Okay, guys, actually, that is the attack mode. So, that is the attack mode for Dread Phoenix P4. It is hideous. He just goes monster. But. What's good about it? He actually has almost the exact same stamina. So that's good. But he does have very low stamina. But it's pretty good. I have to say. So, not a burst finish. As you can see. Still at full health. But this guy. Ooh, he's just decadent. Okay. Guys, let's go to the next match. In our next match, we will have Maximum Garuda. A harder foe. Three, two, one, let it rip. Three, two, one, let it rip. Now he... Okay, he went a bit too hard. Um, He got a ring finish. Um, yeah. As you can see there, let's, so guys, if, if you can see, so this is his attack mode. He doesn't have any bottom, but then this, this is defense mode. And that is in the middle. So he has two modes, attack and defense. So I'm going to put him on defense and see what Maximum Garuda does to him. Okay, three, two, one, let it rip. That wasn't good. The, the whole base stadium shifted. Okay, let's give that another try. Three, two, one, let it rip. Three, two, one, let it rip. Going in for the attack. Okay, let's see what happens. This is looking like a pretty good fight. Can he do it? Can he do it? Can he do it? Dread Phoenix with a survivor finish by 0.2 seconds. Okay, guys, Dread Phoenix. He is a pro. Like, he beat someone he was supposed to, like, be bad and weak against. How's that possible? Let's go on to round three. Hey, guys. Um, so, now I'm... His opponent is this guy, um... Genesis. Blast Genesis. So, let's see if he can win. Three, two, one, live. Rip! Three, two, one, light red. Okay. On site ring out finish. That was very strong. I have to give him that. He is a very good bay. So, guys, just giving you another tip. If you see this Beyblade anywhere in the store, go get him. Because he definitely is one of the best bays around. But, just warn you. He doesn't have much stamina, but that is okay because he is great. 
Okay, let's do this one more time, but this time with him going first. Okay, three, two, one, let it rip! Three, two, one, let it rip! Oh, a foul launch! Well, I just want to see him get his top taken off. His top, that's it. Okay, so this guy, he's unburstable. I have to say, almost unburstable. Actually, since he is unburstable, let's get in some of that spicy action with, who is the, I would take Scallius. Yeah, guys, let's, let's, let's try the one, the only, the, Excalius right here. And remember guys, these are all Hasbro Bays. So you can pick them up at your local Walmart, Indigo, and you can also get them at Toys R Us and Mastermind Toys, any toy shop or most most stores you can get it from. Okay? Three, two, one, let it rip! Three, two, one. I think he accidentally went into attack mode. Yep, he accidentally went into attack mode. I'm I'm sorry guys, but but what? But he wasn't in attack mode. Okay. Let's just say that he does mixed things. Okay? Three, two, one, let it rip! Three, two, one, let it rip! Vanquish your foe! Ah! Okay! A burst furnace to Dread Phoenix. Oh, there! His top, his pop, his top popped off. And Dread Phoenix, two to zero, Dread Phoenix wins. Well, as you can see, guys, for the first time ever, Dread Phoenix's um, outer layer popped off, but he's still at maximum health. So, that just shows you how strong Dread Phoenix can really be. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. It really helps support, and make sure to smash that subscribe button with Hades. No, not Hades. I, I, I'm just talking about a different thing. Tikaratomi, actually. Tikaratomi is like Hasbro, but a different brand, okay? But just a different thing. Um, but make sure to smash that like subscribe button and that like button too with your Beyblades. Go and smash it and make that Beyblade burst. But if that Beyblade doesn't burst, I have to say, go on, verse me. Try to. Try to win. Okay, and I'm just going to excited. Okay, see you in the next video, guys. Bye.